Um, welcome to the channel. Welcome to another video. Today's gonna be a how to draw video. Yay! I'm gonna teach you how to draw you a whooper. One of the tools that you're gonna need is a protractor. You're not gonna measure anything. This isn't school. You're just gonna need it for some outlines. Now let's get started. Your protractor. Put it somewhere right here. You're gonna wanna do, then you're gonna trace from here all the way to the other side, but not tracing the straight line under. I'll show you a representation. Yeah, so now you have kind of like the outline of a rainbow. Or just a poorly drawn. You're gonna wanna do, you're gonna wanna take this approach so it's now looking like the this. The same thing that it did over here, but upside down. Like, now don't mind this little bump kind of accidentally messed up on my thing. Well, it should look like you don't want to do some smoothening on the edges, mm -hmm. right? A whooper's head isn't just ja jagged. It's more of like a curvy oval. Some changes. This comes in. You don't want to like erase about this part. So look what I'm erase. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to make it a little improvement. Kind of made in the curve, basically. Now try the same for the other side. Final result right now. I'm going to go straight to the face, the eyes, and the mouth. We're going to go to the ears. Well, to the Technically, because he's an axolotl, his gills. Protractor, once again now, turn the paper diagonally and go to one of the sides of the head. And now you're just going to draw a straight line like this. Same for the other side. So now if you flip the paper the other way, it's going to look like a balloon, kind of. Don't mind that. It's a balloon. All right. So now what we're going to do, we're going to put... We're going to put... We're gonna do the, we're gonna make the lines longer. This. What you're gonna wanna do is draw a spike, a sword tip. So now, you're gonna draw some, a smaller spike and then a bigger spike. There you go. So we do the same thing for the next one. Same exact process. Now we have this. What I wanna do is, you see this part right here. Okay. You see this part, this little line under under that, erase the lines under that. So now it should look like you have this. We're gonna draw the body. Yay! We're basically gonna do a curve kind of. Thing. It's gonna be like that. Then we should have this. What we're gonna do is that we're gonna draw the tail. The tail is kind of like a pancake. Here. Oh, what is that? Time. Awkward. You're in the feet. Oh. Getting like a smile, like this. Okay, that's a smirk, guys. Little circle. This. Draw two tiny circles inside. Don't do this. Erase the eyes. The hideous eyes. We look cool. And I'm talking glasses. I was using those as representation. What is that? Like a bent line. Like boom, 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 boom. Trust the process, please. Draw something like this. And then just color though the glasses. I outline it. Now we'll just why can't I focus? Okay, now just outlaw outline it. I lot outline it with pen. Wow. Or anything. Erase this small little line. Look like this! Keep outlining. God, those eyes terrorize me. I can color over it. This should be what you have. Well, I'm not gonna color it. Colors to color it. But yeah. If this helped you out, just like, please give it a like. Give it a like. I helped you draw. Look at my hands. This one doesn't count, but I've been holding the camera. Please. Rupert says bye.